What's up, fly guys and fly girls, Abigail's and Mouse? It's been a while and I missed you uh, all. So we are checking out something pretty cool right now. It's called Marble and it's by World Labs and you can get access to the beta if you send the link, uh, send the email to them uh, the, with the link. Do the link and essentially what it does, it just creates a 3D environment from one photo. So it's pretty cool and pretty groundbreaking because it's based on Gaussian splat. Now, if you don't know what Gaussian splat is, I will read you the definition right here. <laughs> Gaussian splatting is a real-time rendering technique that represents 3D scenes using millions of translucent splats or Gauss, Gaussians instead of traditional meshes or voxels. So the advantage of that, guys, is its its ability to create a much more realistic, a much true to the scene kind of photo because it's done in points. And you'll see that once we start using this. So the beta allows you to generate literally unlimited because there is a credit count about, I think, about 5,000, but you're not going to rank through that because it's 50 50 credits per per generation with their top model. So we're just going to do a few. Let's see. Let's do it. Let's let's try one that we did earlier. This one is called September. And what it, and you guys to see, look at that. Those are the points that are rendering and creating the environment. So right off the bat, the clouds are kind of on. But essentially now you're able to walk around in this environment, scroll around turn around 30 to 60 degrees and you're able to walk. So on the controls on the mouse, use your scroll wheel to walk forward and you're walking in your environment. See that? Now again, this is essentially one big dome, one big, one big ball of sphere because if you walk too far, you're going to reach the, the ends of the splats or basically the boundaries and you're going to start seeing a lot of weird things come in. But it, it, it's a pretty good amount. I'm just going to walk to there and see the points. I know I'm walking somewhere. But if you go stay within the boundaries, this is pretty, uh, pretty awesome, pretty amazing, pretty engulfing. So I'm going to go back to what I made. Oops. Um, okay, here, here's one I just did. This is based off an oil painting, and there are in all the points, babies. They're coming around, they're generating, and this is off an oil painting landscape. And again, it did an excellent job recreating that world. So you see it recreated everything here. I'm just going to walk down this path. See that? Able to walk down. I might reach the end of the splat there for some reason. I'm going to walk this way. There you go. Walking through this, see the tree. The tree is nice. The end of the end of the road right here. Uh, but you're able to do that and look all around. So we're going to try another one here. Um, let's do this one we did. This is a... There's the points. This was a simple bedroom setup and with a cartoon type style. So I'm able to walk over here. Can't go in through doors yet, but, but you're, you're able to get really close and change your view. There is the room. Do you ever the walk over here and see how everything basically as if you're in the actual room? Who oh, look, he has a shoebox. Nikes? Nope, baby. That's pretty cool. All right, so I'm going to go back and do. Now it works, does not work with humans. Now you're like, why would I do a human? Well, let's see. I tried it with this shot. A Blanca in a hallway. Now right off the bat, you can see it does not work with humans, but that's not Blanca. Oh, it's a little scary. Uh... So if you don't have a human in your shot, you should be fine. This is an empty room. Because look, if I go and look at her on opposite angle, she's just a flat nest. No offense, Blanca, but you're not flat. 
Uh, and here you just walk through here. That's pretty cool otherwise. So avoid humans at all costs. Avoid humans. Uh, so here's some that they did. Our users did. Uh, and let's just grab this one, for instance. And this is a nice, like, room setting world. I like to look around before I start walking. But yeah, it's really nice. There's stuff everywhere. There's chairs every year. You like even walk closer. Look at the chairs. You even have the above stuff on the roof. Let's see if I can go in this corner here. Yep, there's a chair in the corner, and I can see where I came from because there. Oh, can I go through that? Now, it, this what, marble won't generate other rooms, but you might get lucky by it being able to go through. And this is another room, sort of. I'm in here, so I'm going to turn around and go back up through the wall. Yeah, so that was a good one. Uh, let's see another one that I did. Oops, where is one that we did? Um, this is a bedroom scene. There is the gloss and splats. And if you guys load this up, if you load it, it says it takes six minutes, but we've tried it and, and literally it takes like two, two to three minutes to get these uh, rendered. Uh, and, and, and it's free fast. And we're using the top high quality model. There is a faster iteration model. I don't know the quality of what. So look, this actually created a whole other space right here, like a living room area. I'm just gonna go in over there. Um, and also there's like a little doorway with a hall or a hall with a doorway in it. So I can actually go through the hall, go up to the door. I can't open it, but see how it really adds to the 3D environment, babies. Feels like you're ready, you're here. I'm gonna go up to the window. I'm gonna see, I don't think I can, I don't have a good view. And I don't want to jump out, but look, that's a little chair, and I can see a better view of the room from here. That's pretty cool. So I'll show you how we do it, right? So let's grab, um, let's go to create, and here is how you do it. Upload an image to generate a 3D world. They have presets, or you can upload your own image. Uh, you can actually, uh, you know, there's tips on how to do it. And there's two models, Marble One Mini, which is faster, and Marble One Plus, which is the higher quality. So I'm going to just grab, uh, let's do this. Let's try and throw it off. Well, this is an illustration, and I'm going to generate. So this is an illustration, like a coloring book, y'all. And I'm going to see if it's able to create a world, and it's going to start right here. There's also... Not like worlds. There's also presets and there's also explore. There are plans as well. They're not sent right now because they're still in beta. And as you can see, we have still um, from the free plan, you still have 4,500 credits remaining. So jump on this beta now, guys, because it's pretty awesome. Let me see if I can find where I can really, really walk through. Um, somewhere uh let's see baby babies let's see oh, let's try this one there is a splat all the points being developed being loaded up Ooh, this is kind of cool uh so i'm gonna walk over here oh look at that look at the window now don't you see outside the window and there's a bed door oh that's a nice painting uh go over here and we'll do some painting La, 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 I love you. Uh, and then there's a doorway and you can leave. Now, what if you try to go through the door? I'm going to reach the end of the world. Blackness. But, yeah, you can do a lot. I mean, this is pretty cool. Um, we love it. I, I, you jump on this right away. The beta is available. And make sure you like and subscribe to AI Fuzz, babies. And I will see you next time because guess what? Abigail is in this Blossom Splot house and I'm out the Blossom Splat house because I need to go and splat someone else or splat something. What of that? I'll splat a cat. No, we're not a cat, baby. All right. See you guys later. Bye. Peace. I love you all.